here there's a magic pot that makes everything double. What a marvelous pot it is! The Magic Pot Once upon a time, a farmer bought a piece of land from a rich old man who lived next door. But there were so many stones in the field that the farmer had to work hard each day to sift out the stones from the soil. One day, the farmer was digging in the field when his pickaxe struck against something hard in the ground. This is strange. Is there something in the ground? The farmer kept digging in the ground, and he found a huge pot. What's this? A pot? I wonder what it's doing here. Well, this is nice and big. I will use it to store rice. The farmer brought the pot home and put some rice in it. But something very strange happened the next day. The farmer had only filled the pot halfway with rice. When he looked the next day, the pot was overflowing with rice. Honey, look! Oh, why is there so much rice? The farmer was so surprised by what he saw that he put a brass coin inside the pot. And guess what happened? He found two brass coins inside the pot. The farmer had found a magic pot that made everything double. The farmer put many brass coins and rice inside the pot and became a very wealthy man. The rich old man from next door heard the news about the magic pot and came over to the farmer's house. The old man insisted that the farmer should return the pot to him. What do you mean, old man? Why should I give you the pot? I dug it out of my field. I only sold you the field, not the pot. So the pot is rightfully mine. What? That's ridiculous! Give it to me now! I'm not giving you nothing! After quarreling for a good while, the farmer and the old man decided to take the matter to the local governor. The governor listened carefully to what the farmer and the old man had to say. He thought long and hard about what he should do. But the governor became greedy for the magic pot. Two close neighbors should not fight over a mere pot. I will hold this pot in official custody. Then you two will have nothing to fight over. Reluctantly, the farmer and the old man went back home. That night, the governor secretly took the magic pot home. He put copper coins inside the pot. Indeed, the pot was soon overflowing with copper coins. This is a wonderful pot indeed. <laughs> The same night, the governor's father happened to see the pot in the room. He became curious about the pot because he had never seen it before. 
As he was craning his neck to look inside, he fell into the pot. Uh, uh, the governor heard his father's cries and came running as fast as he could. And he took his father out of the huge pot. But, oh my! Inside the pot, there was another one of his father waiting to be saved. Father? What is going on? The two fathers looked exactly like each other. Each of them insisted that he was the real one. I am real. Oh, I am real. What are you talking about? I am your real father. I am your father? What? That's oh, no. Back to me, I am you ruined because of the magic oh. pot. The greedy governor ended up having to take care of two fathers. That's an amazing magic pot. If the pot were mine, what would I put inside it?